Jamaica, that sunny West Indian playground, has been struck by a devastating hurricane. These amazing pictures bring concrete evidence of the extent of the disaster, as winds reaching nearly 140 miles an hour left hardly a building untouched in the capital, Kingston. Shipping, too, paid a heavy price. Many vessels, including those bringing bananas to Britain, foundered while at anchor in the harbour, one ship turning turtle with a loss of seven lives. The main airport suffered badly as the howling gale tore through the buildings, smashing them to matchwood. Telephone wires were down everywhere. And here's a food store with the roof gone, but vital distribution of supplies went on. A mental hospital housing over 3,000 was left roofless. And at this prison, the police were searching for dangerous convicts engaged in widespread looting. In all, over 150 people lost their lives, and damage to property amounted to 16 million pounds. But we in Britain, through the Relief Fund, can follow the example of the royal family in helping these loyal and hard-working members of our Commonwealth. Jamaica's need is great indeed, as can be seen in one more tragic example of the havoc wrought by the worst Caribbean hurricane in living memory.